Welcome everybody, this is your boy Dry Martino, and we are here with another Grand Theft Auto V PC modding tutorials. Like always, if you like this video, smash that like button, and if you're new here, subscribe for more daily gaming content, and we're going to get straight into the video. Welcome back guys, this video is all about on how to install your Ada 1 custom casual mod inside your Grand Theft Auto V folder. So like always, make sure you download and install all the requirements that's inside my description below and make sure that your requirements is the latest version. Once you guys have completed that, I will leave this mod inside my description so you guys can download this mod. Just to let you guys know that this mod does recommend add-on pens. So if you guys don't know how to install add-on pens, then I do have a video inside my description and that video is called how to install add-on pens tutorial video. So go and watch that video guys and that will show you how to install add-on pens. Once you guys have completed that process, then we're going to get straight into the video. Now, all you guys got to do, okay, before you guys start, okay, is open up your Ada Wong extract folder. Now, inside this folder, we've got two files. Open up your Ada casual folder. And now we have a couple of files in here. You can read the readme text if you want to. It's totally up to you. But we're going to get straight into it guys, so all you got to do is open up your set A folder. Now in this folder we have four files. We've got a YDD file, a YFT file, and YMT file, and a YTD file. We're going to copy all these four files inside our OpenIV. So head to your OpenIV. And now click on edit mode, select yes, go to your mods folder, go to update folder, go to time 64, go to your DLC packs folder, then just go down one and then go to your add on peds folder and go down to your DLC.RPF folder. And then go to your peds.rpf folder. Now in this folder, it is completely empty. So, all you guys got to do is copy your four files that's inside your extract folder. And drag them all inside your peds.rpf folder. And that's all you guys got to do. Go back one. And now click on set B. Now go and select what your YDD file, YFT file, YMT file, and YTD file. And now repeat the process and drag it inside your peds.rpf folder. That's all you guys got to do. And now all you guys got to do next, okay, is click on any of these files, okay, and drag out your adder casual A. And now paste it onto your desktop and your arrow casual B. And then now paste it on your desktop. Now go back to your extract folder. Now all you guys got to do next is close your folder. Click on edit mode. Click on GTA V. And now close down your application. Go back to your adder casual A. Right click and rename that file and now copy that name. Now go to your Grand Theft Auto V game, hover over it, right click and open file locations. Now inside here, okay, you will have your add on PEDS editor. If you guys don't have one, like I said, I do have a tutorial on how to install your add-on pairs inside my description below. So make sure you guys go and check that out. 
So all you guys got to do next, okay, is right click on your add-on pins editor and run as administrator. Now all you guys got to do next, okay, as you guys can see, this application is completely empty. So what we are going to do, click on your page drop down menu over here, then click on new page, and then now paste your page inside your add-on page. Now go to page type, and the type is a female. Now go to is streamed, and that one is called false. And now click add a page. Now go back to your adder casual B and repeat that process. Go to rename, copy the name, go back to your pins drop down menu, go to new pad, and now paste your name there. Go to pad type and it's a female and go to is streamed and go to false and add pad. And that's all you guys got to do. And now the last thing you got to do is click on rebuild. And then now select OK. Close down your add-on page editor extract, okay? Now all you guys got to do next, okay, is right click and refresh your game folder. Exit out of your game folder. Right click and you refresh your desktop. And I will see you guys in the game. And now we are back as Franklin. So, as you guys can see by the textures of the mod, okay, we are on our uh, Redux uh, folder, okay. So, what we're going to do is that we are going to change to Ada. So, now what I'm going to do is to open up your add on pairs menu is to press your L key. And there you go. So now what we, what I'm going to do is that I'm going to spawn Ada Wong uh, A and B, okay? So here's A. And now this is her right here. This is pretty cool. Well, it doesn't look like her a bit, but oh well. It looks pretty uh, cool. And this is B. This is pretty cool too. So what you guys can do, okay? Uh, these are not the only outfits uh, for the mod, okay? You can change the outfit by going to your menu. So press F8 uh, to open up your menu and go to play option, go to wardrobe, front view, and then you can change your head to a different texture or no. There you go. Uh, change your hairstyle. You can change the hairstyle if you want to. I'm just going to leave it as this one. Don't know why. You can change your torso to this one, that one. Um, yeah, either one you want to okay. uh, Legs is the glasses. Uh, and I think shoe. What are shoes? Shoes is nothing. Uh, accessories is the dog chain on the neck. See, Can you guys see it? Um, and that's it, I think. Yeah. So, yeah. And you guys can save her. And if you guys want to save her, all you got to do is go to your menu. Press F8. Go to play options. And then go to, I think, I'm afraid it is wardrobe. Go to outfits. Go to save outfit to file. And then now just say Ada and K. And there you go. And that's all you guys got to do, and that Ada will be there. I can change back to, there you go, and now that's, that okay, and now I can change back to Ada. And now, there we go. And you guys can choose, like, when you press L button, you can choose, like, A. And with A, there's different um, outfits for A. You can press F8 again, go to play options. Go to wardrobe, go to front view, and now there's different kind of kind of um, outfit styles too in this one too. You see, different hairstyles on this one. I'm going to leave it as uh, that. Different um, torsos, pretty cool. I like I like uh, I like that one. Uh, so yeah, um, 
Uh, legs, I think it's glasses. Yes, it is. Uh, and we've got, uh, I think this is an uh, accessory. I think it's another is a, is a dog chain, is it? Yes, it is. So accessory is the earrings and a dog chain. And there she is right there. And now you can save her uh, by using Minyo. So yes, guys, that is how you install Add Along by using Add All Pins and Menu. So guys, I hope you guys do enjoy the mod because I certainly do. All these mods are really, really awesome. So if you guys do get stuck, okay, installing this mod or Add On Pins, then please let me know inside my Discord server or inside the comments, okay. But sometimes I do reply late inside comments because I don't get the notification until I get back on YouTube, okay guys? So, um, if you guys got any questions, okay, and if you guys are stuck installing this mod and installing add-on pins, then I highly recommend you guys comment below and then now let me know what is going on and I'll be there to help you guys, okay? So with that all said, I uh, hope you guys do enjoy this video. If you guys do, then smash that like button and subscribe for more daily gaming content and tutorials. And I'll see you guys on my next video. Thank you for watching, guys. Peace, and I'm out.